One time I was doing it and then suddenly the tiger wake up and I have to run away, you know? Wait, what? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my name is Ricardo Zarate. It's 6.30 in the morning and we are here at LA Fish Company in downtown Los Angeles. Today we're gonna be buying some fish to make this delicious Peruvian dish called ceviche. The ceviche is a dish that is marinated with lemon juice, garlic, ají peppers from Peru, onions and cilantro, it's delicious. So I need to come here at 6.30, 6 o'clock in the morning, you know, to get a fresh catch. Coffee time now. This is the best part of the morning. So all this section you see here on this table is all the fish that coming from Japan. This is halibut from the East Coast. By the way, this is my friend Kenny. I'm gonna make a like a rocotto sauce. It's gonna go very well with this sauce I'm trying to make tonight. Let's take some squid. This is good for lunch. Okay, Alberto, acá está, mira. Filet, y esta también, ya el squid. Right now he's like uh, taking the skin off the, the fish. Now he's gonna start cleaning the squid. So he's taking the oil inside. This is not the dish I cook at my restaurant, but this is something I cook for my friends and I will cook some, to somebody I, I want to introduce Peruvian cuisine. We are here at my house. This is my sanctuary, my kitchen. I'm gonna do like a halibut ceviche with a crispy calamari. I'm gonna teach how to make the leche de tigre. The translation is tiger's milk because in Peru, we believe it's give you the power of a tiger. Red onion, I'm gonna put inside. Ginger, celery stick, and the garlic clove. Fish, so I'm gonna trim it, all the sides I'm cutting in here the trimmings, the rocotto paste. This pepper on the rocotto is like a bell pepper and the seeds inside are black. So this one has a heat, really nice earthy flavor. This is my favorite. You need to think about like you making a, like a mayonnaise, you know? So we're gonna start slowly. You want all the flavors to make into a paste. So I'm gonna add slowly the, the lime juice. This is the leche de tigre. Now here we got my fish that were already prepped and clean. And this is the ají amarillo. This ají amarillo is a Peruvian pepper. Basically, this is just blended. It's spicy if you put the seeds in there, and if you take the seeds and you blanch it, it can be super mild. I would say this pepper is in every single Peruvian dish, almost. So for the ceviche, we're gonna cut like a little cubes. I'm gonna put the halibut. I'm gonna add a little chopped cilantro. The onions can be very strong on flavor, you know? So what I recommend is chop it and wash it with ice water. I'm gonna add like a spoon of ají amarillo. I'm gonna put the sauce in here. Oh my goodness, it's very important to taste. I'm gonna give one more try. I'm gonna do the fried calamari. I'm gonna mix the milk and the egg. Have my flour, which is just all-purpose flour. I put a little pepper and salt. Now we're gonna go and fry the, the calamari. So my oil should be at like 350 de degrees. You know, you need to cook with passion. When you do something with love, you know, when you put everything in there, it will show on the food and olive oil. This is not very traditional, the olive oil in, the, in Peru for the ceviches, but you know what? I found it the best. Probably I would love to cook to, to the end of my life, you know? 